checking on my channel, Joy's Way. I'm Joy. If you're new here, welcome. And if you're a returning supporter of mine, welcome back, awesome person. So today, I want to do my Joy's Way of panning and shopping my stash. It has been two months since I've done this, and I figured it's about time that I get on it again. So I'm going to give you a brief summary or rundown or whatever of the makeup that I've been using for the most part for the last two months. I have four um, eyeshadow singles. Three of them are from Ace Beauty. This is called French Vanilla. This one is Ice Latte. And this is a Cotton Candy. And then this is technically a blush, but I did turn it into a eye topper because it is just um, <clears throat> too sparkly for my cheeks. I don't mind sparkle when it comes to my highlight, but not my cheeks. And this is Happy Thoughts. I had the mini Controversy palette by Jeffree Star. My Super Blossom by IBY. I had Just Two Peachy Mattes by Too Faced. I had the Tinkerbell palette from ColourPop. The Violet by Juvius. I also had the Rebels by Juvius. My highlights, I had the LA Color Strobing, the Wet n Wild um, Hello Halo, and one of my very first favorites by, it's um, from Beauty Creations called Cali Glow. For my bronzer, I used my e.l.f. contour plate in the shade, I believe it is light medium. For my blush, I used Girl Power. Had a Too Faced blush and highlight set. And then one of the very first ColourPop um, blushes that I ever received in the shade um, Metro. Had the Pearlice um, BB Cream SPF. It was okay. I used it just a couple of times. And then I have two of the, um, what is it called? Uh, Maybelline Fit Me in the colors 105 and 115 and I mix them to get 110. They do make 110 but I want buying 110 when these two can do the same thing. Then I had all these lipsticks right here. Um, I don't feel like uh, giving you every single name of them. But the first month I kept track. I was doing really good. And then at some point I just stopped and I just kept using because I have this basket like this and I keep it over here in my little makeup area. And for the most part, I just have used that makeup for the last two months. Every once in a while I have grabbed another palette or another lipstick, but um, I'm tired of using that makeup so I'm ready to move on. My new basket is right here. I'm using the Donut by Glam Light and there's that palette. Give them Lala Beauty. I feel like I may have already used this but I don't care if I did or not. There's those colors. I have Thirsty by Jeffree Star. There are those colors. One of my favorite palettes, which I'm actually wearing today, is ABH Novena, and this is the Pro Pigment Palette Volume 1, and that is what those colors look like. I'm going to be using my Morphe Disney palette. I actually really love this palette, and there are the colors. I do feel like a lot of the colors are kind of the same, but formulas are different, and um, Sometimes when I want to use a purple, I want to use it from different formulas. The last palette, yep, the last palette I have in here is the Magic Minis by Juvia's. And those are the colors. Now, if you'd like to see all the colors from the video, or from the makeup that I just showed you for April, I did put that video up, so you can go back and watch it if you'd like. For my highlights, I want to use my Extreme Frost. That's what I have on today by Jeffree Star. I love this highlight. I'm also going to make myself use this Urban Decay um, gold highlight. I don't like gold, but if anything, maybe I can use it as like a eye topper. And then my last highlight is Glodiant by Art. Glodiant Makeup Palette. Maybe it is by Glodiant. I don't know. 
and this is also one of my favorite highlights. I mainly use these three here and these two I don't so much. Oh, and I put in a fourth one, Ofra. I always grab Ofra once or twice, so I figured I need to start putting an Ofra in every month. Then for my blushes, I'm going to use this Hello Kitty um, Hello Kitty and Friends by ColourPop called At Foresight. I don't use this one. That's why I'm making myself use it because I don't think that color pink is for me, but I need to use some of these makeups. Rather, I think they're my color or not because I did buy them. I decided to throw in my favorite phase 10. This is new. My last one, I finally used all the bronzer and almost all the blush. Um, the one thing that I don't use is the highlight it is just not my color favorite um, trio palette because of these two colors my last blush is going to be the um ofra midi palette setting pretty and the cool thing about this is is it also has a highlight in case i need to use it i forgot about it until i just started opening it for bronzing i'm going to use my juvia's place um bronzed bronzy light i can use both but i do favor that one and then one of my very first bronzers that is my oldest bronzer and i don't even know if it's any good so i'm going to try it is by yancy and it's called sunlight glow i do feel like this is a little bit more on the warm side but i am still going to use it because this is the bronzer that made me love bronzers. I lied. I have another eyeshadow palette. This is the Natasha Denona um, Cupid palette. I have not used it yet, so I am excited. And if I have used it, I've only used it once and I don't remember. For my brows, I'm going to use my um, Juvia's um, browns. Um, normally, I don't throw in a brow product or an eyebrow product, but today I decided to, and this month for foundations, I'm going to use both of these BB creams. This is by Sally and Chick. You can get it at most Dollar Trees for $1.25, and this one is Maybelline New York Dream BB Fresh, and this I paid $6 for like a year ago, and I think it was on sale, so, you know, they're probably no more than 10 bucks. I I have four more toppers. I have a pink one, a white one, a purple one, and a green one. And then I'm also going to throw in this um, brow styling soap. I love this thing. And then I have all of these lipsticks that I don't care to rattle off, but I've got a couple of red ones, a couple of pink ones, and a couple of brown ones, and hopefully I won't be grabbing any more because I'm finding out my biggest problem is is I get bored with the lipsticks that I use and sometimes I get bored with the palettes and then I'll grab a palette from somewhere and use it and then when I'm done using it I stick it in this pile that I have collecting and I'll show you that pile. This is the pile that has been collecting since I started this whole Joy's panning and stat or Joy's way of panning and shot my stash so it keeps getting up there and every once in a while if I can't, if I don't use one of these, then I'll grab another palette and then add to it. But alrighty, that is all I have for you today. I do hope that you enjoyed watching me do my Joy's way of panning and shop my stash. I'm going to try to stay focused and, um, you know, do this every month. But I can make no promises because every time I say I'm going to do something, something ends up happening and I don't do it. So I'm just going to do it when I get the opportunity. And today is June sixth I think so um I'm starting a little bit late in June but if anything if I end up going a couple of months like I did before guess what I got some good makeup to play with this time around Alrighty, like I said I do hope that you enjoyed watching me do this video I hope that you have a wonderful day remember that I do love you remain awesome and peace out awesome crew